come to see the doctor for Maria because Maria is uh, possibly a dwarf with magical powers. Is that right, Maria? Doctors themselves don't even come in at that time. Like you get in there, you're on time. You're there 7.30 in the morning. You have to wait another 30 minutes until they call your name. And then when you get into the hospital and they put you in freaking see your blood pressure and everything, they say, well, the doctor haven't came in yet. So give her another hour. I mean, come on, cuz. And Maria want to take her sweet time, put on her hijab up. The hijab is not even something that you tie. That hijab that she has is like, is a hat. You just put it on. Why did you make us late, Maria? Why did you make us late? It's not me, it's about you. Bro. No, you. You put your hijab. You were in hospital, you were in the bathroom, and you had your hijab covering your face, and you had to flip it over like a hundred times because no, you didn't know which side, which one is it. Why are you calling me? I'm your daddy. I'm your daddy. You don't call me liar. He is a liar. He always be late. He always be late. I'm like, how whenever I was ever late. I'm like, how you crazy? You lying. Like she lying on you guys. Don't believe her words she says. I mean, come on. Come on. You gonna believe her? She crazy. You made us late. Now we have to go back home. And I gotta go to work. Which is unfortunate as well. I was hoping. I was hoping. Wait, shut up, Adele. I was hoping to be late for work, but I guess I'm actually gonna be on time for work. That's crazy. That's wonderful. I'm really. I'm trying to study because I'm really bad at getting girls. So I'm trying to learn from from the mess. He, he's not that good. He's not working on you. Oh damn. Okay. I gotta find a new mentor. I gotta find new mentor, my friend. He's gonna no, take it. Nigga, nigga, oh, that's what it is. Right. Trying to get female, you gotta lie your ass off. You gotta lie to you girl. Telling the truth. You got to see the news. Oh. You lie to the head. Yeah, see the news. That's right. They never lay me because I don't lie. So this little John right here, he came out just recently. Congratulations, coming out. Uh, how was uh, Bobby Schmurder? He ain't he ain't say. You and Bobby Schmurder? Yeah, I know Bobby Schmurder. You came out together? Yeah. So what happened? He ain't look after you? Why are you not in his video? He ain't look out for me. You seen him twerking, twerking the other day? No, nah, you seen you twerking. I'm saying he was twerking. Yeah, you was next to him. I tried. I don't do it. I don't do it good. I don't do it good. Y'all already know who Breezy is, though. What up, Breezy? Yeah, you know, right yeah. This nigga fuck the cops, nigga. Yeah. Fuck all That's what we always say when they're not around. Fuck all the Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> <laughs> Straight from the dome. On, Straight from the dome. Me and my nigga be getting it on. Nigga, we'll shoot you up. Nigga, we'll do you up. You fuck by hope. Be staying in touch. Cause it's calling a nigga on the phone. But they can't talk on my phone. Cause I'm slanging them fucking zones. Nigga, gotta get them off. Yo, nigga, he's got that hard and soft. Nigga, don't really give a fuck about them. My cousin, nigga, I'm the boss. The I boss, walk with the nigga. real niggas. Give a fuck about them holes in the head. Nigga, I'm about to watch your baby. Cause I'm nigga, I'm gonna fuck with them niggas. Oh, oh, niggas oh, oh, oh. Bust the rhyme, who? <laughs> Alright, so speed is a hyposexual dude, right? This dude is desperate to have a girl in his life. And I get it, bro. I get it. Everybody goes through that type of shit, man. Like, you're lonely. You want something. You want some love. But what are you looking for? Because he says in this one video, he says, oh, before YouTube, it was easy to find a girl. But after YouTube, all you, know, you find out these girls, they want something. That's all they want is something from you. So what? So what? Because you want things from this girl. You want to be a, looking a certain way. What are you talking about? There's no... Uh, unselfish reason to hook up with a girl. There's always something selfish. You know what I'm talking about? You're always looking for something specific. You want a, a nice shaped ass, a nice shaped body. You want it to have at least to be independent. You know what I'm talking about? To be able to pay for her food and for her things, right? Like certain people like that type of shit. Like you're looking for something specific in the girls, right? You have what you call a type. I mean, this makes no sense. Right? And then he goes on saying that he's gay. And obviously, he came out with another video with Aiden, right? <laughs> Where he says he's not gay. He's like, Chad, he's not gay. It was a prank. or He's, he's just talking and whatever. And Aiden was like, yo, even if you was gay, it was like, ah! whoa! Oh, 
then you know he started call, call, call himself because you can't be like that, bro. When when you know the gay issue was really sensitive, as you know, the LGBT is gonna come at you. They're gonna come at you. You know what I'm talking about? They're gonna they're gonna freaking stalk you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you guys. I honestly think Speed and Ava are, are trolling. You know because he is known for being a troll. Ava, I'm talking about. Like he been doing it since way before Aiden introduced him to Speed. Like. He'd been doing it on Instagram with all the celebrities or other, you know, semi-celebrities, TikTokers, and everything like that. So, he's known to be doing shit like that, like changing his voice and that. And it's very convincing as a woman. And I think Speed took that because they collabing together, they know content together, and they decided to do this elaborate prank on Aiden and on, on whoever else, you know, like on his chat followers on, on Twitch. Uh, but if it's real, like, if this is, like, how he's experiencing things, like, he's really confused like that, yo, his boys better get his bag, man. And I'm not talking about, like, Aiden. Aiden's talking about, ah, oh, it wouldn't matter if he's gay or not. No, cuz. Like, no, he's not gay, son. Stop. And that's the problem, because how can you, like, be like, hmm, do I want my ass to be penetrated? I think I do. I, you know, no, that's unnatural, son. And I don't care who, who hears this and who was offended by this. It is unnatural to assume that this, that you're attracted to this idea that your anus, which is literally not a reproductive organ, that's literally made to dispose of waste of your body, can be penetrated. And it's okay to be penetrated. And it's okay to be attracted to the same sex. It makes no sense. It's illogical, irrational. And it's literally can justify, in the same basis, can justify anything else. Incest, pedophilia, beastly. All these acts of impurity can be justified in the same basis. So take your brother speed. Tell him, bro, listen, you're not confused. You, you want, you're a man. You're looking for a female. The, the other day he was hooked up like, yo, I don't know what's going with Speed. The other day he had another date with this other girl. I ain't going to say if she was bad or not. I'm, I'm a married man, happy and happily married. Y'all seen the video. Y'all know how she looked. Anyway, it's crazy that he was like, like, wasn't feeling her. Like, you talking about, oh, stay looking for something. Nigga, like, stop playing. Stop playing. Stop being stupid, son. They're always looking for something, and you always looking for something. Obviously, you was Alex and her, if she's thick and all this crap. You looking for something. So, don't be, a, don't be a dummy, son. If you got it like that, then get it like that. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm using my rapping voice right now, my cool voice, my, you know, smooth voice. You know what I'm talking about? Like, it's all about confidence, cuz.